Hello everyone. This is Dr. Purvi Chawla. I'm consultant diabetologist and director of clinical research from Mumbai. Uh, very happy to have been a part of DiCareCon uh, 2023 and a big thank you to Dr. Banshi Sabu sir, the organizing chairperson. So today I uh, debated on low carbohydrate diets in gestational diabetes uh, and I said a complete no for the same. Let me just quickly justify why I said so. First of all, uh, historically we've been using low carbohydrate diets that is less than 130 grams per day or less than 30% uh, of the total energy intake is low carbohydrate and we've been using that for diabetes and we've you know just over time have extrapolated that it works in gestational diabetes as well. However, there is not much conclusive evidence because ultimately it's not the numbers that we are treating but also the maternal and fetal outcomes in gestational diabetes. There are four main concerns with using low carbohydrate diets in gestational diabetes. Number one is that if the maternal glucose levels are not optimal, the maternal fetal gradient is lost and hence the fuel supply to the fetus is compromised. So that is one uh, major uh, impact of low carbohydrate diets. The next concern is the fetal exposure to ketone bodies, uh, which anyway a pregnant woman is prone to uh, developing ketone bodies because of lipolysis, especially in late gestation. However, further restriction of carbohydrates will worsen the case. The third impact is uh, whether the fetus is, uh, uh, has increased exposure to triglycerides and free fatty acids with which further perpetuates the problem of insulin resistance and also impacts the programming in early uh, childhood for obesity and metabolic issues. Uh, so with some of these concerns, low carbohydrate diets are definitely not recommended. However, the very high carbohydrate intake in the Indian patients is also not recommended. Instead, we need to replace them with good carbohydrates, which means complex carbohydrates, low glycemic index carbohydrates, and a lot of fiber in the diet. And this is endorsed world over by uh, American guidelines as well as the Indian Dipsy guidelines. Thank you.